I'm here with Randy Rurick, and uh, he's dropping off his uh, um, latest batch. The latest batch of black tips, and we have a couple new sizes, but we'll go over all the sizes and yeah. why he developed them. Well, well, for the last year or two, we've had the um, seven and a half and the eight and a half. And the, what makes these the best single fins you can buy is the tip flex. That's what's unique compared to everybody else. It's got carbon here, honeycomb in the center, the flex patterns in the, in the top third, and the carbon fiber tip. And the flex is what makes it. So the seven and a half and the eight and a half have been super popular. But guys that had tankers or gliders, they said to me, hey, can you make a little bigger one? So I said, okay. And it took two years to get them. <laughs> but we just got them in, and they just came in, and I'm super stoked. We now have a nine inch fin that works great on any single fin longboard. Look at the tip, the tip flex in that, like no other fin on the market. This is the most responsive fin you can find. And for the guys with gliders and big tankers, I even went 10 inch and check this out. This baby is so good, but look at this. Look at that flex. So you put this in a, in a log single fin, go down and do a turn. As you come out of your turn, it's gonna flex tip here and then snap out of it. And that black tip is the secret what makes these fins so good. So I'm really happy to have a nine and 10 to join the seven and a half and eight and a half. So if you want a cool fin, come into Hawaiian South Shore and they got the goods. All right on. So the, the flex on this, it goes this way, yeah? Yeah, so really thin, super light. Most fins are, are stiff because they're all fiberglass. As you can see inside here is the honeycomb yeah. and the flex patterns in, right here in the middle. And so the tip flex you can see that. Look yeah. at how much flex is in that. When you go into your turn, like I said, it loads up the, the tip flexes. And then as you come to the apex of your turn, it goes twing, gives you a little spring out of your turn and a lot of projection. So that's what makes these fins yeah. so cool. What about, um, you're, are you using it on your um, boards when you surf out in your uh, home break at yeah, uh, I, Sunset? Yeah, I live at Sunset Beach and I usually, I have a 7.6 mid range. So I use the 7.5 with little side bites, little 3 inch side bites. And then for my guns at Sunset, I live right at Sunset Beach, so I surf Sunset time. The eight and a half works really good in the guns. And then when the surf drops down at Sunset Point, it's a little one to two. On my tankers, I've got the 10 inch one in my 10 foot nose rider. And I used to have a, um, a really nice fin in there. It was from um, North Shore Fins and you know Island Fin Design. And Steve Mock makes a great fin, but I came up with a flex on this thing. Put this in my 10 foot board came alive i just blew my mind because i've been riding that board for a couple of years and i just went whoa it just made the board lively again so you want a cool fin for your single fin this is the one thank you very much <laughs> mahalo for checking us out i hope you enjoy the video please continue supporting us by subscribing to our channel aloha